Hey guys, Lucas from Power Pop, and today we're going to be looking at the final starter pack for Wave 3. Um, it's been a long time coming. Technically, there is one more starter pack in the Diamond Gorthion starter pack, but... Man, finding diamonds is just the worst. It is so annoying, and I haven't found any since the first two I found in store, and I've been kind of buying and splurging and getting them. But... So let's just move on to good old Ventus Garganoid Ultra. So this one, this is another one. It has one dupe, but one dupe is better than none. You get Ventus Garganoid, Pyrus Troxford, who is our dupe, and you get a Chaos Hydrus, which I don't believe is a dupe. I I don't think I have one. Yeah, I, I definitely don't think I have one. So Ventus Garganoid, all that good stuff. Let's crack it open. Yeah. Go. Let's put our boxes on and course to the side. I'm gonna always start with the cards. We're gonna get this out of here. I bumped Deku. So we're starting off with our Garganoid Ultra. He has a magic shield and fist Baku core, 400 Bs and 3 damage. Now this guy, I think he has a unique Evo where his damage rating is equal to the amount of energy you have. So that's interesting to me. Pyrus Trox, who is a pretty good Bakugan. Um, shield, shield and Helix Baku Core, 500 Bs, 1 damage, and Victor, you get 1 floating energy. But I think his Evo grants you 3 floating energies, which is nice, and it's a fairly low cost, if I remember right. So, Chaos Hydrus, we have... Two, oh, he can be dual shields. That's cool. 200 Bs, 3 damage, and 1 Frost Strike. Now, I know he has an Evo in Resurgence, I just don't remember what it does, so apologies on that. Also, the card seems really dark. Oh, it's just me. Got Pyrus Strike for a 2 cost. It gives you 3 extra damage, but if it's Pyrus, 6 damage instead. So, pure Pyrus decks. Piercing Scream, a classic. 2 cost, minus 400 Bs. And then a Reflection Razor, 1 cost, plus 1 Frost Strike for each Chaos Bakugan on your team. Now, let's get to our Bakugan. Let's start with our dupe, as always. Oh my god. There we go. Oh, wait, no. We skipped the cores, guys. Jumping ahead. My bad. Okay, so we got a Fist and Shield. Shield's gonna give us for Chaos and Pyrus, plus 400 Bs. That's actually pretty good. And then for Fist, you'll get plus 2 damage. Two more Shields. The Shield will give you for... Oh, same one. So Chaos, Pyrus, 400 Bs. And then plus 150, plus 1. And our last two shields are going to be a Magic Shield and Helix, which is funny because these are actually Ventus Troxus cores. <laughs> uh, so we got minus 200, plus 5, and then the Magic Shield. Will this be a big buff one? Yes, it will! Oh, plus 650, that's one of the best ones! That's good! Okay, so where are we left off, here's our dupe in Pyrus Trox. Oh, he got, he got a little nervous. He was facing the wrong way. We got our Pyrus Trox right here. He's a pretty good one, so like, his fully energy thing is cool. We got him. Let's move on to the next one that's trapped in the plastic who came out a way easier. Okay. So this is gonna be a new one. What? Oh no! Look at him! He's stuck! Okay. <laughs> There's a Chaos Hydrus guy. <laughs> he got a little stuck on that one. Ah, look at him. I love Core Hydras. He's so cute. And then finally, we got our Ventus Garganoid, who I love, and I cannot wait to open his darkest one, which I have. Spoiler alert. Ventus Garganoid always looks good. Garganoid always... I think we have a Garganoid in every faction now. And the last one was the main one, Darkest. Yeah, I, yeah, no, we do. That's awesome, man. So let's fold him up. He is always pretty darn easy for me. He is one of my favorites. Oh, the bottom legs are always the tricky part. You gotta like fully tuck him in. There uh, goes his tail. I think you're supposed to do the tail last, but like this always works out for me. So there's Garganoid in ball form. One of the best looking ultras in ball form, if I may, may say. So where are the cores? Alright, let's get. I can focus over here. Lay out some. Oh no. <clears throat> so 
Sorry, here. Uh, sorry, I had to hear that noise. <laughs> Lay out four cores. And let's get Garganoid to pop open. It's always a fun one to do. Oh my, he got excited. Well, there was Vintage Garganoid, guys. He didn't really pop open like he's supposed to, but. So, that's gonna conclude it for this one, guys. So, this starter pack, the Ventus Garganoid star pack, comes with. As said, Ventus Garganoid. So, Garganoids are always fun. If you don't have one, I always recommend getting at least one because they look they look great and they're super fun when they pop open. Uh, so you got Ventus Garganoid. Got your Pyrus Trox, who's not also a pretty good Bakugan, I recommend as well. And then finally you have your Chaos Hydrus. So that's gonna conclude it for this one, guys. As always. I'm Lucas Powell. Keep popping, guys.